Here's old Watch Gary. Leg, Gary, 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 welcome to the program. But what'd you do the chair over? Well, I was uh, like a midget sitting here. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yep. It's good to hear from. Yep. This is medical what, term, isn't it, Gary? <laughs> this is his first appearance on the show. Uh, you've heard about him for many, many years. <laughs> yep. a lot of Gary, Gary, the bulldozer guy. Yeah, a lot of G- Gary yeah. stories, and we've had a lot of fun talking about uh, <laughs> you know this unique human being. And, and well, uh, let me just say one thing. Here we go. Uh, you know, y'all got this thing to where you know if I say something I ain't supposed to say, it ain't going on there. Uh, we yeah, I'd rather not use it. Yeah. I'd rather not use it, but yeah. I do. Have it, it, I, we got one, but it's a long reach for me. It's a, yeah, I mean, you know, if we could get needed through, it this morning. Yeah, if we could yeah, get we through it without it, that, that'd be great. Well, so, yeah, but okay. it, ain't promising nothing, right? I ain't promising nothing. No, well, and you've been real nervous about this. Why oh you? man, I was so nervous I could throw the sewing machine into running. <laughs> <laughs> you know. <laughs> why, I, why, are you so nervous. Nervous? why are you so nervous? Well, I had never been on radio or Yeah. You know. <laughs> but you know, after hearing that nut y'all had on yesterday. Yeah. Oh, killer bees. Name? Killer yeah. bees. Yeah. 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 You know, I thought I taught country, but yeah. I don't know where that joke was from. Yeah, he's uh, from Andalusia. Andalusia, Alabama. Yep. Well, I figured he's from Alabama somewhere talk <laughs> like that. Yeah, <laughs> now you uh you know, you 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 do a lot of work. You know, mm-hmm. for all sorts of folks that uh, have land, hunting land, or just yeah, yeah. whatever, and uh, you 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 work with us, and you know you've done an outstanding job, and you've had to deal with us, and I know that's that's a that's a yeah, cross that, you have to bear. Uh, you know, I live with it. You're right, you do what yeah. you got to do. You got it, to. Now, um, you were concerned too. You would, you were afraid that if you came across foolish, that Greg would have something to say about it. Well, well do, does Rick do y'all like he does me? What? Does he mess with y'all? Yeah. Constantly. What? What are you talking about, Gary? I have no well, idea. No. I'll be taught. You know, I talk Rick probably two or three times a week. Yeah. You know, sometimes. Sure. And, uh, you know, sometimes he'll call me and not mean to call me. And right. Oh, yeah. I have to listen to him playing baseball or football. <laughs> right. you know? yeah, sure. Yeah. But yeah. does Rick call you too much, Gary? Uh You know, the Bubba plan's a little light. I, well, I you call know, you about I hate, twice a year. I hate. Yeah, he Bubba calls. He says, uh, <laughs> "Go over there and do what needs to be done. Just send me a bill." Right. Yeah. And you know, I won't hear from him in six months. Right. <laughs> uh, Rick called me sometimes, you know, two or three, four times a week. Yeah. You know, just whenever he wants, you know, if I need to change the light bulb in the bathroom, you know. <laughs> <laughs> but what well, you, you know, mean I mess with you? I don't know what you mean by that. Well, you you know, mess with me. Yeah. You know, he called me. He said, uh, here a while back, he said, uh, we was talking. He said, uh. What have you done to Dan Motry? <laughs> oh, no. I said, I ain't done nothing to Dan. I said, I, I eat with him the other day, and we talked about my call. And uh, he said, well, he's mad at you. <laughs> <laughs> then he called me next yeah, day. And uh, he won't let you off the hook. No. Uh, yeah. Weeks two later, he'll say, well, Bubba's mad at you now. <laughs> <laughs> Bubba. And he called Thanks, last man. week. He said, uh. Greg said he thought he could take you. Oh, yeah. <laughs> That's true, though, Greg. I didn't mean nothing bad. Right, about right. It, but, well, <laughs> you know, he, he he messes with me a lot. Well, Gary, but it's all in good fun. I mean, and you yeah. you calling anybody out for messing with people, it sounds kind of weird. You know, at least yeah. I don't. You've well, I'm going to tell you all right up three front times. now. I'm, I'm quitting all that. I'm not doing You're not going to mess people anymore? No. With the Bigfoot shoes, now, they're out. Yeah. We, now, we're, we're talking about a guy that leaves me rattlesnakes under buckets. Right, yeah. right. And your Bigfoot shoes. I, I've had to shoot every bucket on my property before I'm picking up. <laughs> <laughs> what was real funny was, uh, you know, Bubba had two biologists down, and I had my Bigfoot feet on, and I walked through a mud hole. <laughs> And uh, what was funny, I was sitting up on the hill Where watching them. Where do you them. get Bigfoot feet, by the way? <laughs> well, I spent about 80 bucks making them, you know, <laughs> no. on right. a pair of my old work boots. Oh, that's good. And uh, <laughs> Bubba had two biologists. They got out and was taking pictures of them. <laughs> oh, I, I and, told them, I said, those are not real. That That's Gary the Bulldozer <laughs> man that does that. And they were like, okay, do you mind if we get a picture? Yeah. Yeah, he said, well, i tell you what, they look real to me. Yeah. <laughs> Gary, you should have drew down on that dumb bull about that time, make that holler noise. Yeah, got them. you yeah. love that, don't you? Yeah, that's that's funny. You got, you that's got your favorite. That. It. Yeah, that's my favorite. That's one of the scariest sounds I've ever oh, heard. Yeah, oh, yeah. It's horrible. You know, and, and didn't it, you bring one of those up here one time? No, I, 
We had one in there. Who, yeah, who, did? Did. who made it? I don't, I don't know. know. Somebody had one. I, it wasn't I, as, I may give you one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it wasn't as good as We good didn't as. have a pine tree to get any rosin on our hands. Yeah. I'd well. like my own pair of Bigfoot feet. Right. Yeah, me too. Yeah. Right. So, anyway. but I, I mean, turkey. I'd like to run through Scardino's backyard with them. Oh, so. God. <laughs> oh, if we wow. could get Gary's Bigfoot feet in Scardino's backyard, <laughs> oh. God, what a win. <laughs> mm. And then and then let us sit down on that can one time. All right. So, Gary, you you think you have come up with the the finest turkey call to date. I'm not going to say that. I mean, there's, there's a lot of good calls out there that will call a turkey up, but uh, it's a good call. I mean, if it wasn't, I've spent nearly two years on it. Mm-hmm. And you got the state record in Alabama in one, well, one category. Uh, for the spur. longest spur, yeah. On spur, yeah. Right? Number one. Yeah. Right, number one. Spur, Brent Davenport's here. Brent, welcome to the show. Good morning. Yeah, Gary does have longest he, spurs he, shot in Bama, right? He does indeed. If you watch our video on the website, the background bird that's mounted is that bird that was a state record. You can see the spurs in the video on the website. Yeah, cool. If you search Gary Vines, number one comes up All on, right, the so state, on the turkey website. What does Gary come up with here that you think is, is something somebody needs to add to their arsenal? Well, the thing about this call, he let me and a couple other guys down there, and we're we're all diehard turkey hunters, and he let us in on it on the, I'm going to say the ground floor because I think there's a lot to come with this. But after playing with it a while, the, the tone, the ease of use, um, everything about this call is superior to a lot of the other calls on the market. There it goes again. Gary Sway. I think Speedy's put you in the shrink area. Gary, Gary, don't tear the there chair he up. Gary, <laughs> playing tricks on me again. The chairs went to the floor. I wouldn't put a lock on this thing. I, know. <laughs> I told you, watch Speedy, Gary. Gary, how much he, you weigh now? You'd tear the chair up. Hey, it's, that oh. right, it's that right calf. Don't let it hit that little toggle. Yeah. Oh, okay. Sure. Yeah. I mean, the calf that big, you can't help it. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, uh, just like just like a lot of fishing lures, a lot of the turkey calls on the market are, are designed to lure in turkey hunters. You know, there's oh, yeah. always a new gimmick every uh-huh. year. You got to have the latest thing. This call here is is pretty much plain Jane. There's nothing fancy about it other than the fact that it's, it'll kill turkeys. Mm-hmm. Um, it, it's got a tone. You can be real quiet with it. You can get real loud with it, and it keeps the same tone in the woods. Uh, it, it's, it's just a, a simple-to-use turkey-killing machine. And um, Can it, I tell you what I like about it? The knob you hold on to. Well... Uh, I, I like that format better than the stick. Yeah. My website's been up, I don't know, Less probably around two weeks. I've been mailing these calls out to uh, anywhere from Quebec, Canada. Where? Quebec, whatever Quebec? you call it. Yeah. Quebec. French Quebec? Yeah. yeah, Quebec or whatever you call In it. Quebec? Right. Yeah, they've, I've got some gone to <laughs> north of there. That's just north of Let, let me just say this. It's up above, uh, you know. It's on up there. Way up there. Yep. You know? Yeah, right. You know, I didn't even know they had turkeys up there. I didn't, either. I didn't either. You don't hear about Ice turkeys. You don't hear yeah. about Quebec They have a different turkeys. accent, no, though. Quebec. How do they got to be big that? to get through all that snow. Well, you can say it that way if you want to. Some people say Quebec. We're working on a French Well, version. that's just like, uh, you know. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was going to say. Do they have a French accent? <laughs> yeah. And I've been getting a lot of emails and a lot of reviews on it, and uh, people that's got them has really loved them. And, uh, you know, Taking off I've mailed Quebec. them, you know, from uh, New York. All the way down to Florida, Mississippi, Louisiana. There you go. I mean, it's uh, it's catching on, and it's uh, you know, if you like to call turkeys up, you know, you get one. If you don't, you know, don't buy it. I ain't there ain't gonna be no gun on you. <laughs> <laughs> I sound like common liquidation. <laughs> now there's a there's a sales pitch. There's right your there. motto. If you don't want to kill turkeys, don't buy one. <laughs> I don't care. Yeah. Ain't no I gun mean, on you. Uh, I mean, ain't gonna force you. Are we gonna come back? We're gonna hear the the call, <laughs> and uh, and you can find out more about it. We got Gary's website, Original Spur Master. Yeah. is what you need to be searching, and that website's in show notes at rickandbubba.com. Having a blast with Gary the Bulldozer Man. Uh, and you've heard legend of him uh, talked about on the program for for years, uh, and uh, and now he uh, he is here with us and has uh, created uh, the original Spurmaster Turkey Call, which um, has been credited uh, with uh, with bagging the state record in Alabama, and now is available to you, the consumer and the turkey hunter. And uh, we've been talking with him about it, listening to that, reminiscing, and he's he's agreed to give away a couple of them. Which we're about to get into, but um, hey, Gary, will you clear the air on one thing? Where did you shoot that turkey at? The state. Let's record? not get can into you, that. Can you can you say? Let's not get into that because there's a little bit of a debate about exactly where that turkey was taken. No, I can't say. <laughs> yeah. I get it. I understand. Mm-hmm. It was real. 
you know, it was close to your property, but it wasn't on your property. But uh, <laughs> when you say close, are we talking miles or inches? Oh, <laughs> feet. I just rather not say. <laughs> I get it. All right, so I would be good with you taking the state champion on my property. Oh yeah, I mean that would be great. Well, see, I get hey, to claim I grew it. Yeah, so. yeah. You, your your property value you goes up in money. Money on it. Yeah. yeah. Well, now now you know we we've had Chuck Sykes on the program a number of times. Who is yeah. You know, he's uh, what's his official title now in the state? Uh, Rick, he's the state uh, head fishing of something. Game, yeah. Fishing he's game, fishing game guy, commissioner. Uh, I think. Uh, no, no, he's not the commissioner. Oh, he's, not he's, commissioner. The one, he's under the commissioner, but he's like the head other guy. He's, he's the guy that actually does the work. <laughs> he's I the think, guy. He's I the, think the, that's no his record. title, the head other guy. Yeah, but yeah. Uh, he he said he wanted me to compliment you on once again apprehending illegal hunters uh, yeah, yesterday. I, and yeah. Gary, Gary, let me tell you, as a property manager, nobody yes. is better. I mean, I talked to a guy that literally said this. They had about 2,000 acres where he uses for, you know, business clients and things like that. Yeah. He said, he said, when I first got this land, I had a real problem with people stealing stuff, people hunting where they weren't supposed to, people coming on my land. He said, and then I put Gary on it. And he said, that, that all went yeah, away. Yeah, that's uh, you talking about uh, Russell. Mm-hmm. Yeah. He said, it all went away. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. a good bunch of boys over there. It is, great people. Yeah. And uh, so same thing with, with Bubba, same thing with me. And yesterday you caught another one, somebody trying to uh, trying to break the rules. Yeah, you know, you think these idiots to learn, mm-hmm. but you, you, you know, you, you handled that, you called that clown, didn't you? Well, he's uh, yeah, he'd be in court for too long. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I heard you called one that they had to tell you maybe back it down, just not. Ah, uh, yeah, but well, he shouldn't have popped off. Ain't no need to pop off, is there? Oh, yeah. hmm? Gary, it? we appreciate you being out there. <laughs> well. You know, I used to be mean my, my younger days. I know, yeah. I know. That's what Before people you tell mellowed me. out. Yeah. Before you mellowed out a little bit. Yeah, like my grandpa. You know, I he he asked me one time to hold a gun on him while he shaved, where he wouldn't cut his throat. <laughs> <laughs> so you come from a tough. Oh mind. yeah, it's tough. <laughs> it's tough. <laughs> oh, my God. I love this. Uh, all right, so we're going. Are right, we going to give away an original Spurmaster right now? Yeah, we give. I brought. I brought some extra ones, you know. All right, we're gonna uh, give one away. Now, that means you got. Yeah, I want to buy one. That means you got to ship one to to whoever to whoever wins it. Well, I've been shipping them all over the country. So, Rick, wait, to, to where at? Up in Canada. Canada, uh, <laughs> Quebec. Yeah, right. Or whatever you call Rick, it. If we can get right. one to Quebec, you can get. Uh, yeah, if you can get one to Quebec, you Buffalo, can get New York, uh-huh. uh, okay. Virginia, South Carolina. Okay. Right. So I mean, you, it, it, it's going pretty good. You can handle it. Yeah. All right, so Anywhere but between here the, and the thing that I don't like about it is, you know, my phone goes dead about three times a day because, you know, I get emails from my website. Right. Well, you, you and, have to be ready uh, for that. You know, it just takes me so long to respond to, you know, how I can, you know, I'm not like this, you know, people texting. You, you could actually yeah. respond maybe on a computer. Oh, yeah, I got a computer. Okay. You do? Yeah. yeah. You have a smartphone or a flip phone? You go smartphone. <laughs> what are you talking about? Huh? Well, I mean, you don't know what a smartphone smart is. Phone. Oh yeah, smartphone. I got yeah, I got one of them like it. Yeah. Okay. You got one. Uh-huh. Yeah. What's he got? So you don't use What's a two way anymore? Huh? You don't you use a two way anymore? No. Uh-uh. You done with that? All right. So Gary, here's what we want to ask you. If and this will be interesting. If I could see Gary on that bulldozer running up and down the road at Pine Valley with oh. his laptop mounted oh, up there. Oh my uh, gosh! Like they have police cars, right. you know, what well, they're ticking tag. Let me tell you this. I, you know, I don't bulldozer. And my son you, and I'm daughter sorry, what? What'd you on say? a bulldozer. Okay. okay. Uh, you know, I say some words that might not even be words, but, you That's know. Fine. We know what you mean. I'll be running the bulldozer and my phone will, you know, have it on vibrate. And I had to jump off of it and run answer it and hit be my daughter, you know. I heard my son works over at Regents mm-hmm. Corporate Office, you know, right over here. They handle. Mm-hmm. I don't even know so what to do. he handles the high finance. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I don't even know what to do. Right. And, uh, you know, I jump out there and run out there where I can hear and I answered my phone, it's her. She said, uh, what are you doing? I said, well, I was working. <laughs> and I said, what do you want? She said, well, these girls around here wanted me to call. Said, they just want to hear you talk. Oh, yeah. You know. Easy now. Yeah. Turn it down now. Gary, yeah. watch out. Gary, I guess I talk funny on the phone or something. But Yeah, right. No, turn it like, down. I'm almost so. here. I've <laughs> talked to you a lot of times, Gary. You didn't sound funny to me. Yeah, yeah. Right. Yeah, to us, it sounds normal. He's getting after it. So uh, Gary so, actually gave me my not only my first turkey hunt, he also gave me my first lesson on how to drive a bulldozer. By yeah, well, you yeah. know what? There's yeah, a lot of I did better at that than I did turkey hunting. Yeah, you did. 
Uh, yeah. <laughs> Will you remember us when you get big and famous? Because it's gonna be big, Gary. Oh, it's gonna I take off. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, we act, we won't be long. Yeah. You have, won't be long. You have your own outdoor show. It won't no. be long. Outdoor Gary, channel. The, look, the Duck Dynasty guys. You could just walk up and talk to them. Now it takes about Can't seventy. Man, when I was trying to, to film this thing, I, you know, I was trying to do my, my videos to go on there, and mm -hmm. you know, I could see uh, that red light come on that TV camera. I just, you know, I just go to pieces. I could. <laughs> Man, I One little like, LED light. Got you, huh? Yeah. That little red light. A little light come on, you know, and it's filming, you know. Yeah, I said, yeah, I can't mess up this, you know. Now, a guy illegally hunting, he has no problem tackling no, him. No, no problem. Uh, red no. light on. I hope, a, I hope one of the guys that's illegally hunting is not filming it because Gary right. will lock up. Yeah. Right? Well, <laughs> I, had, oh, hey, I, I, I will I will tell you all this, that – that video that's on the website was the first take. So he, uh, you give him a little more credit. Come I mean, on, we went mm -hmm. six minutes. Oh, we, we didn't have an editor or nothing. You know, that's no. raw. Well, you can't tell you it. You can't tell yeah. it all. Oh, you, you can't. You, you look it, original is what you are. You're, you're original, original sperm master, master baby. And hey, I the first time I seen that, I seen me coming up the road. I said, who is that nut? <laughs> you know, I didn't even recognize myself. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't realize he looks so sharp. Man. <laughs> yeah, I was wearing a shirt about two sizes too small. <laughs> Gary, well, is, is we've it, all been guilty of that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. who hadn't done that? <laughs> yeah. Gary, is this the first day you wore a shirt with sleeves? I've never seen you yeah. in a shirt. With sleeves. <laughs> well, if it hadn't been so dead gum cold, I'd have wore sleeveless. But yeah. you know, I couldn't stand it this morning. Um, all right, here's the first question for you to get an original Spurmaster call from Gary Vines. Mm -hmm. If you can answer this question, and, and look, it's going to take a minute unless you know it. You're you're now a property manager. We talked about that. You 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 know mm -hmm. run property for a lot of folks, including Bubba and, and me. Okay, mm -hmm. what was Gary's job before that? What did he do for a living before becoming a property manager? Oh. Do you oh, know that, that one? trivia? I, I I won't nobody guess that. I bet we got some local Chilton County folks who can tell us real quick. Anybody know what that is? Hmm? I like it. All right, let's see. Let's start. Uh, Crisis counselor. <laughs> <laughs> Well, <laughs> Jeremy, <laughs> artist at, at, at Auburn. Jeremy, what do you think Gary did for a living before he was a property manager? Jeremy, I have no idea. Oh, gonna you I just guess. Wow. Been. Yeah, Robert and Vance, what do you think? Uh, working with Alabama Power. <laughs> no, that's good. It's amazing. We've that? seen that transition. Nah, that's, 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 that's there, se there seems to be a pattern Look, there. This yeah, show is right made up. If you come from engineering, yeah. power company, I mean, you've got a chance. Mm -hmm. uh, let's go to Ben in Birmingham. Ben, what do you think you did for a living before that? Ben, I lost Ben. Let's go to Yellow Jim, ben. Jimmy, what do you think? Uh, let's see. McDonald's. McDonald's? No. no. Uh, uh, mm -hmm. Let's go to Chris in Wilsonville. Chris, what do you think? Uh,. I'm going to take a guess because I don't know, but uh, I'm going to say preacher. Preacher? <laughs> nah, my son's a preacher. You got a so. son that's a preacher. Yeah. That's right. Uh, Roger and Coleman. Roger, go ahead. Was he uh, an interpretive dance instructor? <laughs> <laughs> it was close. That's close. <laughs> that was his hobby, not his job. Yeah, Sean <laughs> in Birmingham. Sean, what do you think? Sean. Hey, uh, hey yeah. Uh, was he a heavy equipment operator? Uh, no, no, but, I mean, Ooh, you know, that's, a good that's guess. smart guess. Well, that's, yeah, I mean, that's close. Let's go to <laughs> Shannon in Alabama. Shannon, go ahead. Um, I'm going to say a farmer. A farmer? <laughs> no, no, close. Bigfoot impersonator. Uh, Floyd, <laughs> what do you think, Floyd? Uh, he was in construction. Well, mm -hmm. no, no, again, good guesses. Jeremy, what do you think? Police officer. Police officer? Mm -hmm. uh, uh, he's no. one of those Should now, in a way. The volunteer one now. Scott Dothan, 93.7, what do you think? A welder? A welder? Ooh. No. no. I've, I've, done, I've done just about everything they've had. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Robin can do anything. Yeah, Robin Alabaster. Uh, Where's that dance? Operated cranes. Operated cranes? No. No, no. that's oh, still wrong. Okay. Yeah, you might as well give it away. Chris in Fayetteville, <laughs> what do you think? Chris. I work with a uh, surveying company. Ooh. Boy, all right. Surveying. Good, good one too. there. All right. I bet this is the winner right here. Meets and bounds vines, they call it. This <laughs> is from Gary's part of the woods. They just couldn't get through. But Jesse and Jemison. Uh -oh. Jesse, you think this you know? It's going to be a home team here. Uh, did you have more to Oh, no, he's doing that. No, yeah, well, no. that's kind of given that. Well, I thought that was going to be it. Yeah. Rob, Rob in Florida. Robbie. Hey, uh, it was the uh, teacher. <laughs> <laughs> Bless yeah, the children. Well, see, that won't me teach you. But see, that's what happens when Tommy Lenore is a teacher, and I think he might. Mm, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. That's uh, Gary, you teach us all every day. You do. In your own way. Patrick <laughs> in Selma. Patrick, what do you think? Well, I was going to say bulldozer, but somebody already said it. 
So uh, speech therapy. Speech. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, that's, that, that's what I did. Yeah. <laughs> Noel in Gadsden. Uh, Noel. That boy was trying to be funny. <laughs> no, no, no. Peach Orchard. What's that? Peach Orchard. Well, you know what? That's a great oh, guess. Oh, wow. Yeah. Yeah. He's eating a few of them. Yeah, there ain't nobody going to get James and Clanton. James, <laughs> what go. do you think? James. Uh-oh. Uh, pain Body Man. Yeah! 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 We're Gary, the Bulldozer Man Vines, better known now as the Spur Master. Uh, some of you have been, the some of you been emailing. It's originalspurmaster.com. I know that we had the original Spur Master. We've been calling that. Some of you have been going to that website. That one is that is not active. It's original. Drop drop the word the originalspurmaster.com. Thank you all for letting us know that, that we had the up there. It's original. Drop the word the. Uh, and the website is working, and it is fine, and we've just given one away. Now, this this next one, what's that, Adam? That's on, that's on me, Gary. That's on me, buddy. That's on me, Gary. Sorry, brother. What are you talking about? Yeah, Gary, you gotta, oh, he, he put it on the screen. You he, pay to he put it. We had the wrong website oh. up on the TV. Hey, Pat, don't beat anyway. Because <laughs> <laughs> you know you're on TV right now. No, I ain't on television. Yeah, no, no, you yeah. are. You're on Heart, Heartland. Right that guy that's you right there. There you are, they're, they're watching right in Chicago you, and New York. You're saying, nah, I ain't on TV. You didn't know the show was on TV? Man, don't tell me that. <laughs> no, we are. We're on TV yeah. right now. Are you? Yeah. yeah. That's good. Say hey to Quebec. Hey. Where was it? Hey, Quebec. Yeah. Hey, <laughs> um, <laughs> hey Rick. It's one um, thing to hear, Gary. It's another to see it. Oh, yeah. yeah. We've had some breaking developments in the, in, in, the, in the show here and with Gary during the break, okay. commercial break. He is now, for those of you that want to meet him, he is now going to be at the Rick and Bubba Hunting and Fishing Expo. So you're going to be, be on Father's Day weekend. Uh-oh. He is going to have an original Spur Master booth, and he will be there meeting and greeting throughout the weekend. you got to be there. Rick and, Rick and Bubba Outdoor Expo, 20 years, first time that's we not, ever done. That's not during Turkey season, is it? No, no it, it's, it's all right. It's over. Yeah, it's Father's Day. I mean, well, for most oh, people, for you. Yeah, yeah well. <laughs> Well, we'll Research and that. development goes on, Rick. Right. We're going to check. So, oh, okay. you going to be there? Yeah, I'll be there. Okay. <laughs>